managing files and folders. There are some ways which let you organize the data using the Windows Explorer. Let us learn about them. Creating a new folder. Viewing the contents of a file or a folder. Renaming a file or a folder. Copying a file or a folder. Moving a file or a folder. Deleting a file or a folder. Restoring a file or a folder. Creating a new folder. To create a new folder, the steps are as follows. Step 1. Open Windows Explorer or the drive where you want to create a folder. Step 2. Right click in the blank space. Step 3. Click on the new option. Step 4. Click on the folder option. A new folder will appear in the right pane of the screen. Step 5. Type a name for this folder. Step 6. Press the Enter key. The new folder will appear at the location you specified. Viewing the contents of a file or a folder. To view the contents of a file or a folder, double-click on the folder whose content you want to view. The contents will be displayed in the right pane of the Windows Explorer. For example, to view the contents of the desktop folder, double-click on it and you will be able to view the files and subfolders stored in it. In the same manner, to view the contents of a file, double-click on the respective file icon and it will be opened in the respective software. You can view or edit its content. Renaming a file or a folder To rename a file or a folder, the steps are as follows. Step 1. Right-click on the object, file or folder and choose Rename option from the context menu. Step 2. The previous name gets highlighted. Type a new name for that file or folder. The file or folder is renamed. Copying a file or a folder. You can copy a file or a folder from one place to another, such as from C drive, D drive, or from your computer to a removable storage disk drive, for example, F drive. To copy a file or a folder, the steps are as follows. Step 1. Open the drive or folder where the file or the folder is placed. For example, C drive. Step 2. Right-click on the file or the folder that you want to copy. Step 3. Choose the copy option from the context menu. Step 4. Open the drive or folder where you want to paste it. For example, D drive. Step 5. Right-click on the blank area and choose the Paste option from the content menu. The required file or folder will get copied from the device or drive to the required device or drive. Moving a file or a folder You can move a file or a folder from one device or drive to another device or drive. The steps to move a file or a folder are as follows. Step 1. Open the drive or the folder where the file or the folder is placed. Step 2. Right-click on the file or the folder that you want to move. Step 3. Click on the Cut option from the context menu. Step 4. Open the drive or folder where you want to move it. Step 5. Right-click on the blank area and choose the Paste option from the context menu. The selected file or the folder is moved to the desired location. Deleting a file or a folder To delete a file or a folder, the steps are as follows. Step 1. Right-click on the file or the folder that you want to delete. Step 2. Click on the Delete option from the context menu or select the file and press the Delete button on the keyboard. The selected file or folder will be deleted. Restoring a file or a folder 
When you delete a file, it goes to the recycle bin folder. It is a folder that contains all the deleted files till the time you do not delete them permanently. In case if you have deleted a file or folder accidentally, you can bring it back from the recycle bin folder by restoring it. To restore a file or a folder, the steps are as follows. Step 1 Open the Recycle Bin folder by double-clicking on its icon on the desktop. Step 2. Right-click on the file or the folder that you want to restore. Step 3. Click on the Restore option from the context menu. The file will be restored at its previous location. You can now open and access the file. Or select the file or folder that you want to restore. On the toolbar, click on the Restore This Item option.